What's going on YouTube, GS right here. So in today's video, we're going to discuss about whether you should update to iOS 12 or stay on iOS 11.4.1, iOS 11.4 or iOS 11 in general. So you probably remember that yesterday I made this video in here in which I talked about the fact that there are now kernel exploits available for the iOS 12 and a jailbreak will be possible in the near future. And I told you about the uh, exploit that Umang has, in fact the exploit, because he also has an info leak in here that he posted it in here, the hash is 4, and of course he also posted this in here for iOS 12 pretty much being jailbroken. I also talked about the fact that the exploit in here will be pretty reliable, according to Yumang, who said that it pretty much works 8 out of 10. So it's a very stable exploit. So a lot of people ask me, well, should I update them to iOS 12 or stay and wait for the jailbreak on iOS 11.4.1, iOS 11.4, or even stay on a lower version and jailbreak with the Electron? Well, if you take a look in here, here, iOS 11.4.1 is currently signed, so if you want to stay on iOS 11.4.1, you can definitely do so. And my idea is that iOS 11.4.1 will definitely stay signed even after iOS 12 is released, because of course iOS 12 will be a new operating system that will have of course major modifications compared to the iOS 11.4.1, so I don't believe that they're going to take away iOS 11.4.1 right in the moment they release iOS 12. So yes, in terms of upgrading, if you upgrade to iOS 12, you're pretty much safe at this point if you want to get back to iOS 11.4.1 should the jailbreak be released for iOS 11.4.1 before 12, although I do not see that coming in the future. So speaking of iOS 12, if you go ahead in here on the Apple Developer Portal, if you have an account, you can see that Apple released yesterday a new version of the iOS 12 beta. Now iOS 12 is in beta and it's probably going to end the beta program by September when the new iPhones are released, and iOS 12 itself is actually built on stability and you know compatibility and performance. Apple has announced earlier this year that iOS 12 will be focused on performance rather than features. So if a jailbreak is released for this iOS 12, which is of course better in performance and compatibility and stability and so on, you're going to get a jailbreak for a very, very stable version, just like iOS 10, because as far as I know, iOS 12 is based on iOS 10's source code and not iOS 11's, because iOS 11 was was actually quite a mess. The battery was bad, the functionality was quite bad, the initial versions of iOS 11 were actually terrible, and it only stabilized by iOS 11.2 and iOS 11.2.x and iOS 11.3.x. So yeah, iOS 12 will definitely be a stable one, and compared to iOS 11, in my opinion, it will definitely be better. So if you're not jailbroken right now, you can definitely update to iOS 12, but I would recommend you to update to iOS 12 only when it comes out. Because in my opinion, the iOS 12 will be jailbroken on the release version and not on a beta. It would make no sense to create a jailbreak for a beta version. Betas usually are not very stable, so I do not think a jailbreak will be released for a beta version of iOS 12 unless something, you know, out of ordinary happens. So naturally, I would hit for the iOS 12 release. So once the release is out, if you're running iOS 11.4 or iOS 11.4.1, you can definitely update to iOS 12 because there is an exploit available that can be used for a jailbreak and as far as I know from Yumang, the developer of the exploit, jailbreak attempts are already made and tests are already done in Corellium which is a virtual machine and of course this means that the actual research that goes into the jailbreak has already began. So if you want to update to the iOS 12 you can definitely do so. The features of iOS 12 are actually very good. The beta 12 that has been released yesterday actually fixes a problem that Apple introduced in the beta 11 and the problem is that uh, you got the pop-up with the beta expired please update to the newest version and of course they fixed that and it's no longer popping up so yeah if you have that problem go ahead and update to iOS 12 beta 12 if you're running the beta 11 or beta 10 anyways yes if you want to update from iOS 11.4.1 or iOS 11.4 to iOS 12 you can definitely do so if you want to learn more about the exploit and the possible jailbreak in the future of course you can go ahead and watch this video will be linked in the description down below and this video should explain pretty well the entire thing with the exploit and what it can do and so on. iOS 11.4.1 and iOS 11.4 are definitely not good 
options for a jailbreak right now because there is absolutely no kernel exploit. For the iOS 11.4 there are some vulnerabilities that were released in terms of sandbox escapes but those are not powerful enough to create a jailbreak. Those are important, don't get me wrong, but you need a kernel exploit in order to do that and the kernel exploit is what we have here for the iOS 12. So it's definitely better in terms of jailbreaking. Now if you want you can go ahead and save your blobs for the iOS 11.4.1 which means that you will be able to downgrade in the future but even if you update to iOS 12 normally you should be able to go back to iOS 11.4.1 for quite a while after iOS 12 is released before Apple closes the signing window. So you can go ahead here on the TSS saver and use this button here to save your blobs for iOS 11.4.1 if you want to. But yeah if you want to jailbreak in the future and you're running iOS 11.4.1, iOS 11.4 and even other versions you can definitely update to iOS 12 once it's out. In my opinion it should be a pretty safe bet now considering the fact that we have a kernel exploit for it and of course Uman will release that kernel exploit for the general public. Anyways this is pretty much it guys thank you for watching I really hope this video makes sense and I really hope it helps you make a decision and do not forget to subscribe to stay updated. I'm Geo Snow. until the next time peace out.